Maribel, one day mm -hmm. the, there will be a moon colony and we'll be up there. And instead of looking at the wonders of the universe, we'll be on our phones <laughs> and we'll be trying to post something on Instagram and we'll be like, oh my God, it's taking too long. We're just going to have emojis, though. We're not going to speak anymore, Matt. NASA is thinking ahead in the hopes of making it easy to text on the moon or stream on Mars. The space agency is partnering with Nokia to set up a cellular network on the moon. Later this year, the two will send a 4G network to the moon aboard a SpaceX rocket. The system will be installed on the moon's south pole and then remotely controlled from here on Earth. Now, among the challenges of setting it up, without a technician and dealing with the moon's extreme temperatures. Currently, astronauts talk to each other by radio, but NASA wants a lunar communication system that is capable of supporting high resolution video and science data. And this comes as NASA's Artemis program is underway with its aim to return astronauts to the moon this decade and maybe even with cellular connectivity. Imagine being that repair guy. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> the, just the window, I'll be there in the next billion yeah. years.